What's up? Now let's do Young Buck before I pass out. <laughs> I'm tired. Now when we left off, I told y'all 50 was kicking the beef over the Buck. Now, y'all don't remember, Buck was having problems with 50 with the camera situation one. Buck was having financial problems. And Buck was, you know, 50 loaned him some money, get through the tax situation. So he could be on even keel. And Buck, when 50 did uh, hold on, and at the end of hold on, you hear him lacing camera at the end of hold on. But on the album CD version, it's edited. It don't have a part with 50 going off on camera. And 50 was didn't like that. You know, like, Jodden, I mean, Buck didn't want to put that on there. Like, man, I ain't finna feed me that. And put that on my album. And that's when 50 went out there and was like, anybody can go. If your name ain't Tony Yo-Yo, anybody can go off G-Yo. <laughs> that's just it. So, and he was about fed up that time after they did that. And they had a talk. Things were squashed. Money was paid. So he was back cool. And then they hosting BET. And then they was like, we finna go into this Lil Wayne video. And then Bucks come out like, man, I dust Lil Wayne. You know, like, where'd that come from? And see, the problem was, and this was the situation. And 50 set all this up like a mastermind. He was creating the atmosphere of what was finna happen. Because before all that even kicked off, when the beef was sort of getting started, he knew how to get in contact. He had Shaw Money get in contact, and he was going to do a little couple of shows out there in Miami. And when he was doing some shows in Miami, in the Florida area, they had their little show, 50 was doing it, putting it together. He had Trina on a couple of those shows. Trina was coming out there. They paid for her to make an appearance at the club. Talk to Trick. Talk to all the giving them love. G-Unit and all that. And Trina was trying to get close to 50. 50 was like, mm, you know, my buck, my boy Buck here want to holler at you. So Buck started talking to her. So she was like, bad, I'm cool with G-Unit. They got money. But at the time... She was dating Lil Wayne. And then she ended up getting pregnant by Lil Wayne, supposedly. But she was kicking it with Buck. Now, how far they got, I don't know. But I know Buck was all in her ear. Buck was hanging out with her, taking her places. She rolling with G-Unit. What was that? So after that, all that, that all they needed was just that weekend or that week, two weeks they was kicking it or whatever. And they made their money and to her, it's just business. But to them, it's bigger business. So, so Lil Wayne, you know, she go back to Wayne or whatever. And then they break up because once he started finding out about Buck and all this other stuff, Wayne wasn't too happy about that. And then she said she had a miscarriage and was not. And some people said she went and had an abortion because she realized the baby wasn't Lil Wayne's and Wayne and all that stuff. And it was some other dude named Carlos that she was messing with in Miami, some club promoter, whatever he was. So it was a big old mess. And so Buck put out a diss song called Class in Session. When he first started dissing him, and trying to get a rise out of Wayne, and talking about how they used to drive him to school and all this stuff. So Buck was back at it, you know. He got his new album coming out, Buck the World, and he going at Wayne, you know. So that was some buzz. He felt that that was going to get him over the top. Now, Bank is one of the, one of the coldest dudes in the unit. Him him and, uh, and Lloyd Banks, I mean, Buck is... Deal. But the fact is, the fact is, 
50 is not going to let you outshine him. That's just it. <laughs> so you got to stay in your lane. Buck was like, man, I'm finna try to outsell 50. And they went 50 like, you don't say that now. Now stay on Lil Wayne. That's your job. That's going to sell you out. That's the niche we need. But they came out with a mixtape because they wanted to get the invasion of the body snatchers and they dissing Joe and everybody on there, including Lil Wayne. And that song, You, 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 You. <laughs> It ain't my fault that the kid ain't yours and you bought everything in the dresser drawer. It's hard to see. Ain't hard to see these dudes weep in them hoes. The only things get. <laughs> he basically told the whole thing Buck did. You better stay with Carlos. She breaking them off. Hey. She should have stayed with Carlos. <laughs> so. Naturally, the beef ended when uh, when Buck left G Unit, and then two years later, him and Wayne met up, and they got a chance to talk man to man for the first time, and God knows how long. And it was like, man, I ain't even worried about that. We brothers, and then it was yeah, man, F fifty, and F fifty got to squash his beef when he met up with Floyd and all them. They he really didn't have no beef no more. wasn't going on no more. But once they met in the ring after one of Floyd fights, they dapped it up. Brothers, you know. It was dead. There no problems. And 50 had wanted to do that for a while, but he never had the opportunity to. So, that is that. So now you have the one and two all explained together as to why these things happen. It's all for, to generate money. That was it. No real beef. And nobody did nothing to each other. So it just shows you how crazy and screwed up the game is. <laughs> that you can create a beef that's not a beef. Just to try to make some money. And exploit somebody else's weakness. And Lil Wayne weakness is hoes. He will go through a lot of them. He ain't going to be faithful. Everybody know it. He's going to make about a thousand babies and keep on child support everything. And these stupid girls going to keep lining themselves up because they want somebody to take care of them. They out me popping. <laughs> so let me get with Lil Wayne. He a suck. That's all it is. It's your boy Carcino. I'm out. Follow the playlist. The truth behind hip hop beefs or whatever it is. I got sports beefs. We got a lot of a lot of playlists out there. Just go to the playlist section and, and enjoy yourself. I'm out.